another glorious morning. Makes me sick. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new here, welcome to my channel. I'm Robbie Z with Robbie Z Makeup. And today we are doing a super fun Halloween look based on one of my all time favorite movies, especially around Halloween time, which of course is Hocus Pocus. What's not to love? Witches, children, Halloween things. <laughs> It's just one of those movies that's like really funny and I could watch it over and over again and never get tired of it. Oh, and excuse the hair. Sorry, there's no poof today. No, I didn't cut my hair. Um, but for today's look, I'm going to be wearing a wig that you see in the background. I mean, you know, I can't have my poofy hair with a wig on. So it is slicked back and um, we are going to jump right into this video. Uh, I'm going to start by covering my brows today, something that I've never done but I've watched like three or four different videos and I think I kind of got it. I got my glue stick. I got some alcohol wipes for before and then I've got my foundations and stuff. So we're just going to jump right into this and see how it goes. Here we go. So based on the video that I seen, how they did this is we're going to coat the brows in glue the purple glue, the drag queen glue, and we're going to stick all the hairs flat. And I think they did like four layers of this, letting it dry each time. And then, um, you know, we'll see. Let's get our purple glue stick and we're going to go from the outside in and just coat everything. And then you're going to take this little brush and put them all the way up. Okay. <laughs> My thing is, is like not being able to get this off later. <laughs> I don't know if I'm doing this right or not, but I mean, I feel like it's working. I feel like they're like super flat, but I don't know. I'm going to take some air spun powder to set the brows. And from what I've seen, you're supposed to like push it in there. And then I'm going to take my Kryolan TV paint stick and cover it. You know, for my first attempt, and what better palette to use than the new ColourPop Hocus Pocus palette? Cute, right? Let's see here. I think I'm going to use Hello Salem and On Toast because her eyes are fairly brown. <laughs> so let's do that. I'm using where my brows were is almost kind of like the line for the eye. I've got my movie for reference here. I'm glad I'm making this video though because this video is a trial run to a Halloween party I'm going to. So in the shade on toast to go around because that's where it looks as darkest. So let's do that. Okay, then I'll take the same on toast and sweep a little bit into my eye just to give the eye some more depth. Am I going to look just like her? I doubt it, but I'm going to try. I'm going to take my Rare Beauty eyeliner and then just line my eyes like normal since she doesn't have any fancy wings or anything. I'm 
Now she does have lashes and I do have lashes to put on today. However, we're not doing that just yet. I'm gonna take a little bit of this little night of frolic, just a tad, and go right in the crease. I just like to add some depth. I think we're gonna move on to foundation now because I need to do the, my face so I can do under here. Set it with some more air spun. <coughs> and a bronze as usual. It's always weird contouring a nose shape that's not mine. <laughs> I'm going to take a little bit of Hello Salem again, right underneath. And then I do see a little bit of eyeliner on the outer third of her eye. And then I see a little bit of white on the waterline just to kind of pop open the eyes. Everything's a mess right now because I got shit everywhere. Hmm. Oh, I guess I could do lashes. All right, girl. Open up your mouth. I just found her more red blush. Yes! This might help or it's gonna look really bad. <laughs> oh yeah, that just sets it on top of where it needs to be, you know? We need to conceal our lips, so I'm gonna be using the NARS Pot Concealer to cover my natural lips. I'm gonna take a red lip pencil by MAC and Cherry and make her little lips. I'm gonna use um, Jeffree Star's Red Rum, right? Yeah, it is. It is. Um, as much as <laughs> this is my Winifred look, I'm getting like either like a um, Red Queen or the Joker <laughs> from Batman or Batman or um, uh, who else? I don't know. I can't. I can't think of who it is.
All right, this is the look. Um, I need to go finish putting on the rest of my costume so everyone can see it. So I'm gonna do that and be right back. Book, come from mommy. Well, younger. But it's a start! Oh! <laughs> his punishment shall not be to die, but to live forever with his guilt. Anytime I wear teeth, it's always so hard for me to talk in. <laughs> but I think that's the point, you know? But I am obsessed with this. Hang on one second. Ah, better, okay. So I did style this wig myself. I got it on Amazon. I will put the link down below. Um, and I just went with it. It's a lace front wig, super cheap, and I just feel like it, oh, it's starting to fall a little bit, which means I just need more hairspray, but that's okay. This was super fun. Um, I love Hocus Pocus. Oh, and I don't have a necklace either. It's coming in the mail. It's not here yet. Just like everything else I ordered is super late. However, um, what a blast. Um... I love Halloween, and I think this Hocus Pocus look turned itself out, which is fun. I want to thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Um, follow me on Instagram, at Robbie Z Makeup, and all my other social media handles are the same. And remember, beauty is what you make it. No matter how it turns out, you can always take it off. Have a good Halloween. If you guys are going to be Winifred too, let me know. Put the links down below so I can see them too. And where are my sisters at? Until next time my little pretties. Have a wonderful Halloween! <laughs> my wig almost came off.